Happy Thursday, FlowJack Connector. Sean, back at you with another high ticket tune-up. Hope you're ready for this one today. We're going to talk about something called Yes Sets. That's when you're standing on stage and you're looking out and you all of a sudden see all the heads moving up and down. Yes, yes, yes. Or if you're in a sales call and you're getting your prospect to agree with you, yes, yes, yes. Well, we're going to talk about how to use that technique coupled with some NLP today in our high ticket series. Stay tuned. What's happening, Flowjack Connector? Sean back at you with another high ticket tune up. And today we're going to talk about yes sets. What are yes sets and how do we build NLP pacing and leading into them, right? What does it equal? How does it help us in our conversation? This is something that you can use anywhere and everywhere only if you promise always for good and never for evil, okay? Always for good, never for evil. I'm just gonna repeat that a million thousand, hundred thousand million times. So how what's a yes set? Well, let's dive into a couple of things. First of all, where did it come from? Why are we talking about this today? Well, Ralph asked this. He said, Sean, are there any secrets you use to get meetings to go faster while decreasing the amount of time on the Zoom or the phone? So again, how do you make meetings go faster while decreasing the amount of time on the Zoom or the phone? And we, as I was talking with Ralph, one of the things I heard from him, he says, my average sales call is about 62, 63 minutes. I'd like to shrink it to about 35, 45 minutes. Is there a way to do that? And I said, yes, there is. There's actually this technique. I explained it to him and he was like, oh my God, this is amazing. I can't wait to try it. And so he went out and uh, he's going to report back to me and let me know how that's going. Let's just dive right into it though today. All right. So how do we use yes sets and uh, build NLP pacing and leading into them? Well, first of all, we got to know what these are and how it works. Well, what is yes sets plus an NLP pacing and leading? So this is a sales technique. Again, in the old school sales tradition thing, one of the things they used to do all the time is they say, get your prospect to start saying yes, 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 in a row, typically three times. If you get somebody to say yes three times, well, then you're moving forward. And that was all they used to teach in the old school version of the sales technique. However, some psychologists came along and said, that's really interesting. If you're getting people to say yes, if you add in NLP pacing and leading, like the framework of it with that yes set, then what happens is you create progressive momentum and agreement with future ideas. Like how much awesome, how much more awesome is that? And so this is how we accelerate uh, what we're doing. So how do we use it where, where when do we use it right so to get someone to agree with you and then to add in something you want them to agree with uh, uh, with you on in the future so basically the idea here is we want to have yes sets uh, as we move on to the next one, here's the pattern. So we have first true statement number one, they have to say yes to it. Then you add statement number two, and they have to say yes, because it's true. And then you add as the third part of the yes set, we're doing these in sets of three. So if one true statement that they can't deny that's true. Second one, same thing, they can't deny that it's true. And then the statement you want the prospect to say yes to or to believe when you do this, and you do it effectively, you create a hypnotic trance, and then it allows you to lead the sales conversation directly where you want to lead it at any time. It gives you basically that permission to dive into the next topic or talk about the next thing so that you can, um, you know, shorten and again for Ralph to shorten those those conversations from 60 minutes down to 45 or less. And so when we start using this in the beginning of the conversation, it looks like this. Here's an example. As you're listening to me right now, true statement number one, you can't deny you're listening to me right now if you're listening to me right now. So as you're listening to me right now, that's number one. And you're learning this fascinating technique the yes sets plus the NLP pacing and leading. You're learning that right now, unless you've already learned it, right? But this is another true statement you can't deny. You will only use this for good and never for evil, right? Now, I don't know if you're gonna use this for good or for evil, but I'm I'm, I'm combining something that I want you to do, but then also asking you a question at the same time. Boom, this is a superpower NLP yes set. Um, and, and, and of course, fill in the blanks, just use the, um, use the pattern, right? So true statement number one, plus true statement number two, plus the statement you want them to believe, and then I typically would throw a question at the end of that. That technique can be used in the beginning of your sales conversations, in the middle of your sales conversations, close to the end of your sales conversations. It can be something that we could close a deal with. Example would be, man, Today, we can't deny that we uncovered exactly the problem that you're facing. And I've been solving this exact problem for the past 20 years. And so all it's going to take is for you and me to lock arms and jump over the threshold and move forward. And, and um, it's definitely going to solve your problem. Wouldn't you agree? Well, yes, yes, yes. Right. And all of a sudden, I've just closed that deal. 
using this particular technique. And so that's one way of how you could do something like this. Again, true, true statement number one, true statement number two, and then throw in the statement that you want them to say yes to at the end in a yes set. Now do these sporadically. I try not to do more than about two max of three of them during any sales conversation that I'm having. But at the end of the day, this will get you to where you want to go. And when you get there, guess what, right? Oh, and then Jim, Jim, hey, Jim, he said, love that Jack Nicholson meme law. Yeah, man, good to see you. Hope you're really doing well. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, that's it, guys. You just been tuned up. That's what's up. And so with that said, I, uh, uh, Jim says super smart. I love that. Yeah, well, I'm glad, dude. Please use yes sets plus the NLP techniques, man, equals hypnotic trance and you will close deals much, much faster. So with that said, you just been tuned up. There's a flow chat connector inside of each and every one of you. Make sure and smash this like button, share this out uh, to the algorithm so that we can feed it to more people. We got to feed those algorithm gods a little bit and make sure and subscribe to the channel. I can't wait to see you next time.